But before I get to your first challenge, I would first like to introduce to you the sixth contestant who is going to join you. He is, I would say, a dark horse. He is a wild card, a last minute entry to the competition. He's the youngest contestant to join you at 29 years old. Miriam? Brokers. Meet Marcus Chu, an independent licensed broker from Binondo, Manila. My name is Marcus Chu. I'm a real estate broker. I've been a real estate broker since 2009. So if you're a freelance, you have more options to offer to your clients. So that's when I decided to just go freelance. The properties I mainly handle are residential uh, villages and uh, commercial properties around the central business districts. My clients are mostly locals. Well, mostly Filipino Chinese and uh, yeah, local Filipinos who are based here in Manila. Well, my usual work day would uh, start with me opening my emails, reading text messages, and then I yeah, look for properties that may be interesting to my buyers so that I can offer them to them. I just work at home, but uh, usually I'm out visiting properties or visiting my clients and showing them around. I think what, what, what made me successful in this field is uh, my, my hard work and uh, perseverance and the support I get from my colleagues as well who help me in growing as a better real estate professional. What motivates me is uh, the fact that I can, uh, I can be flexible in my time. I don't need to be in, a, uh, in the office on a fixed schedule and I can enjoy my family and uh, my life by uh, not working full-time, but being full-time. I'm very excited to be here and I'm um, looking forward to, to learning from my colleagues who are also here and learning more from the contest itself. I need to gather you now and let you know who's part of which team. Agnes, could you please step forward? Albert, would you please step forward? Marcus, step forward, please. The three of you will be teamed up for the first challenge. And those at the back, Karen, Victor, and Robert, will comprise the other team. We will give you time to come up with your own team names later on. But now, it's time to reveal your first challenge. We will be giving you a multiple listing that contains different properties in different areas, different price points, and in different states of completion. Now the challenge is, you need to be able to collaborate and work together and come up with a marketing or sales kit. We're going to give you exactly one week to come out with a sales kit. We will not give you additional information because we want you to be able to get the information yourselves. Now, the important thing to remember is that although you will be collaborating, the seller or the broker that brings in the buyer is the one that gets the points for that property. Collectively, the team that is able to come up with a marketing kit that best suits our qualifications will earn for their team and their respective members three points automatically. And collectively as well, the team that is able to sell the most properties in terms of the number of properties are going to earn for themselves five points each per member. So with that said, here are the properties. The first property is a pre-selling condo for the student market in San Marcelino Street, Manila. The second listing is a bare one-bedroom unit located along Timog in Quezon City. The next listing is a one-bedroom, fully furnished RFO condo unit right across Wok Wok Golf and Country Club. Our next listing is a condo tell unit along EDSA near the Mall of Asia. Up next, two lots in an exclusive gated subdivision in Baliwag, Bulacan. And finally, five pre-selling townhouses at the heart of Marikina City. So those are the listings. Uh, I think the listings that we gave you, they're pretty easy. Given your caliber, I think you'll have a pretty easy time finding buyers for these properties. 
we will be giving you your broker superstars email accounts and in those accounts you will have access to the information on these listings that we just mentioned so I guess there's nothing left to say but good luck contestants and may the best team win next week we will go on an ocular visit to some of the properties in order to find out how our brokers will plan and evaluate before they can market a property for sale. What do brokers need before they can market a property? How do they evaluate a property for sale? Find out next week on the next installment of our search for the Broker Superstars.